laid out blowed, but very quickly, I just wanted to say, yes, I am devastated that Kawhi Leonard has injured his ACL. He should have been able to be playing for the rest of the series. Clippers had the best chances of playing the toughest teams and winning, but on um, a foul that didn't need to happen on a leg that should have been okay right now. Uh, Tough news for us Clipper fans. We felt like this was our year. It could still be, but to not have Kawhi for the rest of the Jazz series is... Uh, that spells trouble. A lot of guys are going to have to step up. Luckily, we have the bench and the players to do such thing. But man, is that rotation getting tighter. Kawhi Leonard was big on offense and defense. I don't know who else is going to be able to fulfill his role. Marcus Morris comes to mind, but then who's going to take his spot? Looks like we're going to have to defend, depend a lot on Rondo and maybe even DeMarcus Cousins. We're going to be seeing him again, guys. Interesting few games we're going to have right here. We're just hoping right now that the Clippers only have to have Kawhi Leonard sit out for two weeks. An ACL sprain apparently takes two weeks a lot of people are saying these tend to drag on longer these injuries oh, I'm staying optimistic I haven't quit on my Clippers team though so I'm only gonna call it when I see them be eliminated I'll just say that for now too devastated to talk anymore so I'm gonna just leave it there Brooklyn I have nothing to say about you Hawks, Sixers going on right now, but I'm more focused on this Clippers at Jazz game. <sighs> Tweet at me at MR underscore E Reyes Parron on Twitter. And uh, let's get through this Clipper Nation.